any police. There is no any security on the door that the people attack to me. So, we arrived at the team hotel where we are waiting for the teams to arrive. We got some gifts. Oh, we have some nice luggage gitis, right? Yeah, yeah, What's yeah. inside? Suspicious package. But uh, I think you should tell the story because there's a story behind this. There's a story about Nigel Hayes Davis inspired merch. So he liked what he saw in Basket News shop. And he actually asked, you know, to deliver him something. And I actually brought him to Game 5 in Monaco, some sweet 50 points uh, merch. He, and he liked it so much, and actually his teammates liked it so much that they asked like, hey, why we don't have that yet? So we decided, you know, to be nice, to be polite, to be friendly. Guys. And we sent this special package. We got more than enough for not just the players, but probably the staff as well, so. And a lot of 50s, <laughs> a lot of 50s out there. But not only for Nigel Ace Davis, right? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We, we have also... some nice stuff inspired by Olympia Kos, and we also have some fresh <laughs> Everything's Kos inspired. Stuff. Everything's inspired. A lot inspired. of inspirations in, on Basket News shop. So, yeah, yeah, these are coming live on the shop as well. Since you have swag, right? And you're really good at clothing. Oh, take a look at it. Take a look. And tell me what you think. Okay, okay. Can I keep this? Sure, no, sure. I have like four copies of it, actually. I can give it to your, hi uh, to your guys. Thank you. I can't wait. Uh, now I have a big decision of who, who will get up. Exactly, who exactly. You have three, so. This is hilarious. Yeah. Good to see you. Man. I love it. Like it. So it actually looks like a luggage of money, you know, in yeah, the movies. Like an yeah. Movie. Okay, Nigel. Love it. <laughs> it's solid, right? Love it. Like from the movie scene. Absolutely love it. Exactly. Okay, yeah, I'll just carry like this then. Okay, okay. I will help yeah, you. Yeah, I don't want to steal anybody's luggage. Thanks, man. Yeah, no problem. <laughs> no, even though you're always against me. Just know I remember. Just know I remember. Wow, I remember. wow. Just know. <laughs> Thank you guys so much. You're going to give to the guys. Hope they love it. We are visible. We love you. We believe you. We will take the trophy. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Oh, yes, yeah. Apparently, these were Fenerbahce fans. <laughs> Apparently, you were really wrong with your prediction. <laughs> Flares, flags, chants, Scott and Wilbekin, Meli Momotoglu jumping, then dancing and then, the fans. And then the fans seeing uh, the coach, Jessicavich, is going away for a dinner or something. No chance, no and chance. <laughs> call off <laughs> all your dinners. If these fans call off all your dinners. The best team arrivals yeah, yeah. ever, ever. And I didn't expect it at all. I mean, you probably can expect in, in Berlin, but I didn't expect that specifically Fenerbahce fans are going to be the ones who are going to make the moment of the arrivals. Well, 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 how the turntables...
Fucking organization. Fucking organization. Yeah. Not the union. Yeah. Fucking organization. Yeah. Okay. That's fucking organization of the union. Hold on. There is not any police. There is not any security on the door. That the people attack to me. Who is respect and to attack? Where is the unity? Where is the unity? Coach, yapma, coach. Where is the unity? Coach, barma, coach, yapma. Get it on your own. Why don't you break my head? That way, get it on your own. Get it on your own. Chicken burda. Chicken burda. Chicken burda. I will not make any interview, okay? Not any interview. Punish to me. Just punish to me. Okay. There is no police, there is no security. Nobody make no interview. Okay, go everybody on the field. Okay. Nobody interview. Go on the field. Okay. okay. I will not participate also on the press, press conference tomorrow. Okay. Punish to me. Come on, guys, stop, stop. the toilet I come upstairs coach Ataman is already screaming you were outside you saw what happened but we could have predicted this and we predicted that something's gonna happen before even two hours ago we see the group of Fenerbahce fans and we see like zero police forces no police was there and then they drove away I mean there were hotel security like three five guys I saw two guys at most like it was a ticking bomb it was a ticking time bomb and the thing so. is, there were so many Fenerbahce fans inside of the hotel, not even, you know, outside waiting, but there were so, so many of them inside. Maybe they're staying, some of them, but... but uh, there, I think there was no problem with them. It was yeah. about it was, the it was guys about the... outside. And I think there is no problem with having fans outside and even chanting something. But there should have been more police yeah. in the space. Yeah. They should have put them way more far like a away barrier from the team. or something. Because around. now they started chanting and coach responded and they started running yeah. at Pantai Cosplayers, yeah. coach. I was a bit shocked because there's this Matias Resort family, including a small child, meters away from aggressive fans, you know, mad Pantai Cos people and just like it was yeah. it was just a, such a bad scene man that was really really frustrating but then what was happening inside of the lobby uh with coach atman being absolutely furious and then some people even uh trying to yeah trying to make it worse because some guy was just laughing teams arrivals were smooth we were we were like oh nice to have another bunch of fans you know to support their team yes. everything was nice but all what happened there was so unnecessary and it could have been easily avoided. I'm just glad that it all settled down. Police came in and at least, I mean, I, I mean, of the course. Hotel, the lobby was full of full police, of police forces. Full of police. And the other one had a long discussion uh, with the police forces. Yeah. Right? I, mean, and I mean, he was saying, let's go back to Athens, but I'm glad that was just, you know, I mean, this is what's happening right now. Like, but I'm, I'm glad that, you know, he's probably gonna calm himself down and at least, you know, not leave early or I, I just want to have basketball, you know. The worst part is that it's not, it's no longer going to be about basketball. This yeah. Final Four, oh, yeah. I don't think it's going to be about basketball. I wish it was about basketball because we were about to witness some amazing basketball. I mean, we might still. We will but still, but it's going to be the all these stories around. I mean, this whole mess. And I mean, the animosity between the fans now, I mean, I don't want to speculate, but you can only guess let's that it's only going to go up. Let's nothing. Let's not spark yeah, anything. Yeah. I mean, let's okay, okay, enjoy okay. a peaceful atmosphere, peaceful With rivalry on the basketball court, and you are best supporting your team in the stands. Yeah. Nothing else, because everything else is so unnecessary. 